Welcome back folks, you're new tonight. So this is something a bit different. Uh, not so much for camping, you could use it for camping for air tents and things, but this is more for a paddle board, boat, boat, dinghies, paddling pools, whatever you want. But this is a nice bit of kit. So for tonight we're going to look at the Whale 20 PSI rechargeable SUP pump. So it's the Whale Shark Pro. As you on it, you can use it for paddle boards, inflatable boats, swimming pools, beach balls, inflatable tents, everything I've already mentioned. So that's the box it comes in. Let's have a look inside, see what's in the box. It's full of goodies. Comes with car charger. Comes with obviously the mains charger as well. Plug. We'll through the kind of specifications in a minute, but I'll just show you what's in the box first. Obviously, it comes with a variety of different connections. So, as you can see, it's a good wee selection there. So, basically. There's one to fit just about everything. And this is ideal because the current pump I've got, electric pump for my paddle board, that connection is just a wee bit too small. I think it's that connection there I've got, another one. This is far superior, this pump. This really is a top of the range pump. So, comes with them. Comes with a couple of O-rings. Take it, that's a spare fuse. And then this is the pump. So it's a really, really nice pump. Can I just give you a kind of look at it? Bottom of it, so already actually got a car charger fitted to it. The actual hose part, quite a neat idea, it all kind of slots into the side of it. But again, just all pops off. And then it's just a case of basically you can screw it on. It's obviously got an intake and an outtake valve as well. It's basically the Airbank 20 PSI SUP air pump or the Whale Shark Pro. Uh, it's a smart inflator. It's also got a deflator, it's got an auto off, AC discharging, AC DC charging. It's ideal, like I say, for inflatable stand up paddle boards, boats, all these kind of things. It's got quite a large battery uh, within it. It's a 60 watt fast charge battery with a 12 volt 7500 mAh battery. It's able to pump up five 10.5 boards. 20 psi on one charge which is really really good right, it only takes 20 minutes of ac dc charging to pump up a single board so obviously that enables you to get ready on the way to the shore or wherever you're taking your paddle board right, it only takes two and a half hours to fully charge the full thing right, you can also use it as a four volt uh, 22,500 mAh power bank to basically juice up all your devices so your phone your laptop, whatever it is you, you, you bring with you. Uh, it's the only rechargeable two motor paddleboard pump that can pump SUPs up to 20 PSI, so very, very unique. Right, first stage for maximum speed is 350 litres per minute, and second stage for maximum pressures is 85 litres per minute. Only takes eight minutes uh, to charge up a board to 15 psi it takes about 10 minutes to pump it up to 18 psi right it will automatically stop when it reaches the target pressure as well right, it's also equipped with a digital thermometer a eh, barometer sorry uh, it's got an led display which i'll show you it's far more reliable than any other kind of pump right and deflating obviously just stop the pumping time all unwanted air has been exhausted to avoid over deflation. 
It's got a high tech compressor integrated combined with a Teflon piston sealing high strength engineering plastic. So again, like you say, the wheel shark basically allows you to pump up five paddle boards to 15 PSI. So five in a row for one charge, which is really good. Right, it's also, I think I showed you, it comes with a, the full set of nozzles. Uh, full set of nozzles. Electric air pumps, no problem. I'll pump up a paddle board, a kayak. Pools, swimming rings, inflatables, you name it, it'll pump them all. Right, it indicates a pressure, you just basically type it in what pressure you want it to go to, which I'll show you in a minute, and then just let it go. Right, it'll automatically stop uh, when it gets to its target pressure, so basically it's easy peasy. Right, obviously the deflation feature as well is quite a good addition to it because it's going to help you pack up as well faster after you've finished paddling. Right, the, it does, let us say, incorporate this deflate option, so it'll save you a lot of time and effort uh, once you're finished, if you've been out your paddleboard, your pump inflatable kayak or whatever it is. Right, I think I showed you earlier, it's got the storage feature as well uh, for the cable. The hose also clips into the side of it, which I've showed you, and it's obviously got a handle on it so you can carry it as well. Right, it's gone through a lot of kind of rigorous testing. Uh, package dimensions, it comes in at 33.9 by 22.8 by 14.4 centimetres. Weight wise, it's not the lightest, it's 2.8 kilograms, but again, you're not going to be carrying it with you, so. It's got nine lithium ion batteries, which are obviously actually in the unit, so basically they're already there. It's obviously it comes in a kind of blue colour, the material it's made out of is plastic, uh, and that's basically that. So what we'll do, we'll show you actually how it works. So I've already charged it in the house with the kind of mains cable. Obviously you can charge it on your way to where you're going, it only takes 20 minutes. You'll see here, it's got the inflation and the deflation. Very simple. The hose, let's say, just pops out, kind of wraps around, round the side, and then you just pop it off, screw it on. Same with the nozzles, very simple. It's just a case of putting it on, screwing it in, and basically that's you, you're good to go. Operation wise, very simple, it's just got an on button. Uh, you can adjust the PSI depending on what you want it. So it's just a one press you hold it. You'll see the digital display up here. I don't know whether you can make that out. Just with the light. But basically then you just adjust it. So I've got it set at 12. I don't know why it's kind of flickering on this because it's not flickering on the screen. It just seems to be flickering on my phone. Right, obviously you, you can just adjust it to whatever you want just by pressing it up and down. I've just got mine set to 12, which is the kind of minimum for my paddle board. Once you've set the PSI, then it's just a case of pressing the on button. And then basically, if you want to deflate it, then it's just a case of you press this button here, and then... Then So that's the Whale Shark uh, Pro 20 PSI high pressure SUP air pump. Highly recommend us. Very, very nice bit of kit. Very well made. Powerful. Let's like say it is only 20 PSI portable air pump you can get. So next time you see me out, I'll be utilising this and get out in the paddle board and basically show you it in action and actually show you me using it and blowing it up but that's just to give you an unboxing good impression of exactly how it works what it contains the box etc so thanks for watching folks if you don't mind give the video a like i will put a link uh, down below where you can purchase it uh, from the company and we'll catch you in the next one adios